Hey YouTube, Briar Barbarian here. I got a story for you. I went on a little shopping spree and bought a new pipe. I was at my local tobacconist, uh, Bladder and Bladder. Um, I just had to pick this up. Why I had to get this specific pipe? Well, there was actually two on my mind. The last time I was there, I caught a, caught my eye on two pipes and I was just think I couldn't stop thinking about them, practically dreaming about them. And one was made by them it was a bladder and bladder pipe. It was a partially rusticated bent apple and it was beautiful. And I went today and it is sold. Ugh. But the second one I was I wanted, which was a Peterson pipe. I do not have a Peterson system pipe. So I saw this one and I've been thinking about it and I, I just wanted it. It is a Peterson System XL305. Box here, give me free extras like pipe cleaners, softy bits. So here you go, Peterson bag. And this is the larger one. They have smaller ones, this is the larger one. Hopefully the lighting can show. One side is a lot of bird's eye. I can get it on there and flame grain on the other. It's a beautiful large size pipe for Peterson. It's not like house pipe size, but it's a good size, good size jaw hanger. Uh, it's got the P lip. I like those. I don't know. Something different. I like how they're done. So this is my first uh, Peterson system pipe. And at the shop, they were saying how great these are. Uh, it holds back the, it basically lets the moisture sit on the bottom, but let the smoke flow freely. So there's no gurgles. I don't know if sometimes you guys have experienced that where either you've been smoking too long and you get a lot of moisture in the bottom or just the tobacco is too wet and you get quickly an accumulation of moisture at the bottom. So every time you draw in, it's almost like it sounds like when you're sipping a soda with a straw and you get to the bottom and there's all that ice and everything and it gurgles, it's kind of similar to that. So this system of pipe is supposed to stop that, that even if there is an accumulation of moisture, it doesn't matter. It just keeps the flow uh, of inhaling without the gurgles should be no problem. So I'm curious about trying this one out, XL305. And the moral of this story is too, if you see a pipe, best bet to grab it when you can. Cause it was like, when I walked out of the store, I just want to punch myself in the face. It's like, oh my God, that pipe is sold. But anyways, at least I got one out of the two. Thank God. Anyways. All right, guys. Have a good one. Thanks a lot.